Hey everybody, Car Basics, we welcome. We're gonna do the uh, 2018 uh, Topps Chrome number 22 right now. Uh, if you would come this way, oh, uh, we had I had I had them not too long ago. Uh, R.M. Becker and my goodness, are they tasty? It's got it's got me it's got me wanting them uh, wanting them too. I gotta find some wing places that's open uh, a after midnight around here somewhere. Nothing happened, John. I just I got I got what uh, seemed like just some some dead space there for a, for a little bit, and I'm sure it was just because of the lack of interestingness in said stream that caused it. So. Alright, let's get these open. Yeah, John, I may suggest a refresh just because unless, unless you're just dropping one to drop it. As soon as I get done with this with this particular stack, I will. Yes. It always goes up before. At least I mean, I, I always somebody remember somebody remembers before I do this. It was it was already ready. Cut a couple a couple of uh, your longer last names off, but I. Th think I think you get the idea We caught up now, John. We caught up now. And there will be many other fillers of awesome hotness to be involved in. Yeah, I am just going to create a giant trash storm here. Let's see if we can't make this look like a hot, 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 hot mess of hotness, shall we?
Okay. Any predictions on uh, on what awesomeness we're gonna we're gonna yank out of this? I'm thinking I'm thinking something magical because Jesse already said that it was kind of like a like a, a soft first half, which then one would make you think there was going to be like a better second half. These cards are kind of sticky. A Trevor Williams autograph for the Pirates. We're going to start off with the uh, with that. Yeah, these these do not flow like a uh, a uh, Chris Davis in green. A Hunter Wood autograph for the Rays. A Santander autograph for the Orioles. All rookie hotness. All rookie hotness all day long. A uh, Sepia Salvador Perez for the Royals. And a Miguel Gomez for the Giants. Good old Miguel. Oh, me and Miguel go way back. Like uh, like mid eighties back. Garrett Cooper for the Marlins. Everybody everybody loves uh anybody that plays for the Marlins because if you if you since since you're a fan of a good team you're gonna go ahead and assume that the Marlins are gonna are gonna have like excellent talent. Then they're gonna build that talent up to the point that they're gonna trade it off. So your team is gonna get somebody good like Garrett Cooper and Anthony Banda uh, once they have re reached uh, peak potential. Yeah, dude. There's some security guard that works here. Freaking nature who does not in any way make me feel secure. Who I think does like also does uh, uh, like like some security work for the like for the Marlins because he because he because he was telling me like he stopped me in the hallway one day. I had an elevator I was trying to get into. Stopped me. I missed the elevator four times. Because he's like he's he, he's telling me like oh I love baseball so much you know I got to go to all these people you know all these baseball players you know personal events like you know working security and stuff but I mean n you know nothing wrong with it but I mean I, I I think that he might be gay he's overweight. And he is not a force to be reckoned with, if uh, if there if there is some kind of a situation that, that were to go down here, Mookie Betts, really just the overweightness and the 
Well, I mean, really, just I mean, really, I guess the overweightness is the only, only thing that's a uh, a Guerrero for the Marlins. More Marlins stopping him from uh, shutting down any any terror terror threats that we have here. I don't know his name though. I got I got to find out his name. He's a nice dude. I just I'm just mad that he made he made me miss an elevator four times. I guess that's more what it boils down to. Man, he nah, cause cause he, all he do all he do is sit and be on his phone. This guy he he walks around constantly, but he's always on his phone. Like he and his phone like he just puts his phone on speaker, so he's just walking around talking to son talking to somebody. On his phone, on speaker, while he is, you know, securing the perimeter. Or whatever. A Victor Carantini! Purple Refractor Autograph for the Cubs! No, cause I mean, cause Blart cared. I don't think I don't think this dude act, like necessarily cares. He just knows that he's got to he's got to be on the move, and he's and he's constantly. I mean, I very rarely just see him like sitting around, which is weird. But but then like also he's got like he's like his fingernails are like are like this long, like all of them. I mean, it's like it's like he's he's got like ten coke nails, which is just weird. It's weird all the way around. A uh, blue uh, Renfro. And a Tyler Wade for the Yankees. I don't know, again, even like when I finally did get into the elevator, this lady that works in the office, like right beside us, like you know, got in with me. Like I kind of like tagged on to her to like jump in and be like, okay, I gotta go. And she was like, oh, he's so sweet, isn't he? And I'm like, yeah, he's he seems pretty nice. She's, and and she's like, but I don't feel safe with him here. <laughs> like, okay, man, you probably right. You probably right. I mean, that's what it looked like right on time. It's what it looked like. But he definitely ain't thin enough to to ha to have like to have a coke problem. That's 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 for sure. Dylan Pierce Marlins are absolutely laying waste to this thing. Third or fourth Marlin autograph so far. What's going on? Rah rah, it's been a little bit since I've seen you. How are you doing? A blue J Bruce to one fifty. You still you still in your neck of the woods, Kyle Farmer for the Dodgers. It, it, it barely worked, Ra Ra. It barely even worked. I had I, I had to fight for it even. Home for good, or are they still they still they still talking about send, sending it out like you know like just you know just one more time, rah rah. 
you know, you, you know, you know, we need you to be out there because they just don't know what they're doing, and, and you're the best guy that we got. You know, can you help us out? And you know, I mean, just just one, just one more trip out, then I promise, like all the rest of your uh, rest of your stuff will be, you know, will be all here. Is that is that the situation you're running now? And another Marlin and Alcantara. Son of a motherless goat. It's almost like uh, friggin' nature paid me to uh, make this happen or something. And, it, and, and, and if he did, I have not gotten that check yet. Hey, Gallegos for the Yankees. I'm assuming that it's in the mail, freaking nature. I mean, I, I know, May, I know, I know. Miami mail runs uh, slow. A hey, uh, Arenado in green. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. No, you're right. I did get that nineteen dollars. <laughs> Machado in purple. Uh, it's it's true. A Vieira White Sox autograph. Yeah, I mean the Mar the Marlin the Marlins and the Yankees are the ones ca causing the uh, hitless problems. And Alex Wood for the Dodgers in purple. Redemption. Who's redeemable in this? It is a Gold Wave Hotane. Gold Wave Hotane. That's a good card. Fred's at uh, at, at his uh, his little bar, or you know, at, at his brewery with his wife. No, we got we got one White Sox card. We we just got the just got the Vieira. Just got the Vieira. So if if Axios comes back, I mean, I guess we, I guess we'll have to, we'll we'll have to tell him. I knew there was a banger sitting in here. That's a nice card to fifty. Brandon Woodruff for the Brewhahas. <laughs> yeah, I bet you would. I don't, dude. I don't think he would take all of the autographs that are uh, in this at this point uh, for that card, and rightly so. Hey, Mortana, Morontana, Mor, Moranta for the Giants. And a Hunter Wood for the Rays in blue. Yeah, dude. I mean, it, it's it's a good it's a good bat, but still, it's a good card. I could say that it's worth anywhere from three dollars to seven hundred dollars. I mean, I I don't know if the pay, uh, Jake Lamb in green. If the paper itself, you know, might might be in a recyclable, you know, dollar amount. Yeah, that's the only thing. I mean, like probably most of them have sold, you know, a Jack Fla a Flaherty autograph. Nice one for the Cardinals. Uh, have sold, you know, more than ninety days ago. 
But even more than 90 days ago, I, I bet they I bet they were getting a getting a G. And a Starlin Castro gold wave for who else? But the Marlins, 19 out of 50. And a Paul Blackburn for the A's. I think that's probably going to finish her out. All right. So we have got autographs for uh, Blackburn of the A's, a Flaherty for the Cardinals, a Hunter Wood in blue for the Rays, a Moranta. Wait, what did I say? Moran. Moranta for the Giants, a Woodruff for the uh, Brewers, a Vieira for the White Sox, a Gallegos for the Yankees, the Alcantara Marlins, Farmer Dodgers, Peters Marlins, Wade Yankees, Carantini, Purple for the Cubs, Guerrero for the Marlins, Banda for the uh, Diamondbacks, Cooper for the Marlins, Gomez for the Giants, and Tender for the Orioles, Wood for the Rays. Trevor Williams for the Pirates. And the very disgusting Otani Gold Wave Refractor Parallel Rookie Autograph for the Angels. So thank you, everybody. We'll get us right to it.